Hurricane Dolly is making landfall as we speak in South Texas. And according to plan, we are now uh, working through the three steps of uh, the process. Dolly has been downgraded from a hurricane to a tropical storm. But some officials are still worried about flooding. 100 mile an hour winds and about a foot of rain fell on the Gulf Coast as the storm moved inland from South Padre Island, Texas towards Brownsville. By the time the storm made landfall, it was an impressive Category 2 hurricane, much stronger than most people had anticipated. Those winds took their toll, tearing the roofs off of several buildings and forcing storm surge into the roadways. By midday, Padre Boulevard, the main drag through town, was completely underwater. course, with that kind of wave action, with that kind of wave action and longshore current that we had last night, huge chunks of debris were bought up on the roads. And this is what we found once we could get out about noontime today. Roads were just littered with debris. And I mean, we're not talking about just a little pebble here and there. These are huge boulders that are sitting on the roads, and in some cases, entire buildings. And they As daylight reached the um, coast this morning, we began to get an initial view of uh, what the damages were and uh, what the impact of the storm has had on the state of Texas. And I think it uh, is clear that it was very significant. Uh, Texans endured the, the, this storm together, and today we're pushing even harder to get life along the coast back to normal. Pointing fingers has passed. These problems affect Texans. 
so Texans are going to fix it. That is our responsibility, to get this job done for our communities on time and, and within budget. There's nothing uh, more important.